Welcome back, everyone, to another exciting episode of Chemical Reacts. It's a me, Fusion Form, and over there, like always, is my co-host, Gorilla Fist. How's it going? And today we have Season 2, Episode 32 or 8 of Reincarnated as a Slime. Ooh, last episode was very tense. I I got out of bed. What's oh, that word I'm looking for? Basically, I had oh. a bad feeling in my stomach because you were like, oh no, a she's not in there. Your I'm like, yeah, then she was like, she's not there. And I'm like, oh, I hope she's not there. <laughs> How'd you like her? <laughs> okay, well, there's still someone she's... missing or not accounted for. I'm sure uh, we're going to see the right everyone else in this episode. Plans are going to be made. Um, I can't take much more griefing. I didn't show much in the last episode because it was just minus, but if it, if something else comes up, I, I whew. Nah, it's, it's a plan of action, but first we gotta hear out, um, uh, um, what her name is. Still can't say her name. I, it's so hard. I, it's, I don't no, know. It's it, my, it, my, 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 I don't know. Anyway. Muron, Muron, just call her Ron. Mew, Mew, Muron. <laughs> Mew, Mew. I can't. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, I can't do just it. move on. The girl with the blue hair that started the barrier. Yeah. Yeah, her. Uh, we're going to get the bottom of we're, everything revealed from her to Rimmer. That's definitely happening this episode. Mm hmm. But the episode's titled Hope. So, I don't, Is it? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what that could mean, but. Yeah. It's, yeah. All, okay. all, all to hope. <laughs> All right, so before we start, if you enjoy reaction to this episode, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Also, come join our Discord, Twitter, and Patreon if you want to stay up to date or get access to our live reaction footage to this series or many more. And without further ado, Fusion, I got my think it's up. In three, two, one, go. Literally took her heart. <laughs> <laughs> that is crazy. Interesting. I like how it's in a, in a jar, but it has that, like, that spell or seal. Right. Because most would just be like, I took your heart, put it in a chest, and it's somewhere. <laughs> he has too much wine in that wine glass. <laughs> I don't know why, but that, the way that character design reminds me of the, uh, if you remember Blue Exorcist, that one demon teacher. Oh, uh, yes. Yeah, I know exactly. Like yeah. A, Sorry, but I don't have time to deal with punishments. It's a point of action. All right. I mean, she's just going to jail or a holding area. Oh, it's the old man, Haru. I'll call him Haru. It's wrong, but okay. Everyone's safe. Oh, alive. Gabuta, you're alive! <sighs> My child! <laughs> Did you get stabbed in the heart? It never did show us who took that blunt of that hit of the sword. Yeah. Man, that skill's broken. <laughs> Maybe I'm, I'm alive! Maybe Maybe I'm looking Wait. too much into it, but the fact that it has factual energy effects, right? If Rimmer consumes too much of it, will it affect her? And then I understand and she consumes everything, but like... And in fact, in what way? Like, it was like negative energy, like they couldn't... He couldn't be healed because it was stopping the effects of the potions, what I'm assuming. I don't think... I don't think it's negative energy. Or something, I don't know what it is. It blocked... It stopped them from healing. Uh... And she had to basically consume whatever that was stopping that healing to heal him. Oh no! No. Damn. <gasps> Her heart is broken too! <sighs> I told you a main character was gonna die! Oh. Uh oh. He angry. Damn it, too s right. <laughs> I mean, come on, I don't know. I don't have to explain if you've ever been in a situation like that. A hug just comes from nowhere and just breaks you. Hmm. Oh. 
That was unexpected. Who didn't say that? Oh look, it's the the trio. Mm. That's a lot of bodies. Mm -hmm. Oh, I don't even think his mask can hold back his rage. Oh yeah. Ah, don't get me wrong. I love that there's a there's a out, but at the same time, like no, keep it like this to make it more impactful and meaningful. But it might, it might have, a, this might be a different impact though. There might be some like big consequence for it. You, you think Rimmer would sacrifice his life to bring her back? Bring everybody back. You're right. Yeah, she would. Uh, these Price. bastards. Some like dark magic forbidding stuff. <laughs> Not Damn though, like, that's part to revive. Or to revive. Oh, oh, maybe. Maybe maybe some demon lord shit. Uh oh. She's an elf! <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> Actually. Yeah. Elves lived for a long time, so they would know some stories. This is about Milam? Aww. So how's so how does that resurrect them if they become evil with no source? That's a good question. But most likely they're just gonna like overlook that and be like, nah, that, that wasn't the case. No, slime doesn't do that. So I'm sure they're gonna have some kind of reasoning. But not overlook it, but like give it some like mumbo jumbo. Yeah, see, it's right like... here. It's right here. Okay. <laughs> ha, pie. <laughs> it's so rare. <laughs> well, if it's pie percentage, then it can't be wrong. I think I think it's it's I think they're trying to signify that it's like pie. It keeps going, going, going. Even though it's a snow number, uh, there's still a chance. Is what I guess what it's doing. Oh, so he needs to be. So he's gonna become a demon lord. She's royalty. <laughs> These revelations. Oh, okay. <laughs> I like her more. <laughs> They're going to die. Well, I guess we know why this episode's called Hope. Yep, to give you hope. <laughs> a new hope. First, it gave you devastating news. <laughs> a third barrier. <laughs> we got barrier. another barrier. Okay. He has to kill people. <laughs> 10,000. He has to break his own rule. Hey. And look at hey. that! Look How at convenient. that! Ten thousand <laughs> human souls. <laughs> Twenty thousand. She should become a super demon. <laughs> oh man! The other guy doesn't even know. It's like it's perfect. Why would you say that? The army's invading us. <laughs> oh my god! I mean, you think you can escape? <laughs> you really think you can escape? Oh. Okay. <laughs> There's your confession. <laughs> Isn't that that's, that's something all guys should learn by heart? <laughs> oh, he is trying. If I get rid of that whole connection and clay man. Oh, you think? I mean. 
it does nothing to benefit Rimuru to kill her. You might be right. Oh. Uh, uh. <laughs> You're probably right. Oh. Oh, we gave her an artificial heart. Is that a ruby? <laughs> so basically, she... Her, her life's in, like, Rimuru's hands now. Yep. She's so confused. <laughs> So I'm assuming the plan is to give everyone artificial hearts? Well, I don't know about that. I mean, that's an interesting idea. Well, it's not that, because remember I told you how about, like, oh, like, if they take the soul, but, like, they're dead, if they don't come back the same, so, but if she puts a little bit of herself, good? I don't, I don't know. If she can control that kind of thing? It's, I mean, it's a plot. Oh, oh low-key jealous. <laughs> 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 oh my god. <laughs> then it'll be, I only gotta wait a hundred years, then it's my turn. Ah! Oh! Oh! <laughs> <Dig>. <laughs> oh! Oh! Prepare for battle! He's making another kingdom, basically. But for diplomatic reasons. Yep. Okay. If you have a king that's <laughs> human, that I, likes... Did you see what he said? I missed it, sorry. He said, if I'm going to become the demon king, you're going to have to join me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. This shit getting good. War Council! You know, generally I'll be like, you know, speed it up, but here, I like it like this. I can tell you're happy. <laughs> I don't know what I am. Rimmer is going to end up breaking his own role in killing humans. Yes, but... I mean, it's kind of called Bad for. humans. <laughs> bad humans. But like I assume that... Mm -hmm. Well, I feel like he's now going to be like, yo, uh, so I'll, I need all of you to also kill humans. And oh, that's good. Oh man, well, I get it. Like that's how it needs to happen. But man, it just kind of breaks my heart that he has to that he's forced to end up this way. Yeah, but that's kind of the reality of basically. Rimuru it is. Kingdom. It is. And it's like it, you clearly, like, you, you can clearly see Rimuru go from like I was naive, going from to angry. It's just like when he was talking to the Dwarf King, mm -hmm. right? And it's like, man. Um, there's another barrier. <laughs> yeah. All right, you know what? No comment. It's just another barrier. Okay, That's so the it. souls, the souls are possibly trapped within these other barriers. Shinon's dead, which was, I guess, I guess that so a major character died. Only one though. What about the goblin? No one cares about the fucking goblin. Only you care about the goblin. I don't know. <laughs> Someone else in the comments is gonna also care about the gob. I care about gob, but so. Caring about the gob. Um, Either way. By the way, that, that that crying that the other goblin did. Intense. Uh, yeah. I don't know if you remember that. I was like, oh, man, he's really going at it, man. On a different note, we got a Millum backstory. Yes. That's... That was it. I'm not. I didn't expect that one. Um, Which, now looking back, it explains why she's looking at the window at the town and why all that stuff was going down. Well, I don't, I don't know about that. I mean... No, it makes sense, like, you know. Well, no, well, me. there's a the whole thing that we found out that, like, Clayman's, like, the lord of manipulation. Maybe, I don't know, maybe Milam's under his control. Yeah, I'm just saying, like, regardless, I understand now why she acts the way she is. <sighs> I feel like she's a bubbly, happy girl, and she wasn't in that. She was looked like a zombie. So I'm just, I'm just saying. I, I'm ready for. I, I can't wait for the next episode. <laughs> yeah, that's interesting. I was like, cause, uh, I was thinking like, okay, well, first of all, they're gonna wipe out that the kingdom's like, you know. Yeah. If they wipe him out, it's gonna look bad, and every it's gonna basically every human's gonna look at that, what just happened, and be like, yeah, we gotta get rid of that. We gotta get rid of the beast. You're right. Like, 
But then, uh, then Rimuru had this bright idea, basically including him as the king. I'm like, ah, I see, I see. You know? Like, oh, yeah, basically, what I'm trying to say, a lot of the reasoning in here is not dumb, you know? Or at least... Oh, yeah. Not, definitely. Not fetch. That, so like, we have... Because like I said, we, we poke holes on that whole uh, Milam, you know, story. And we're like, that doesn't mm -hmm. make sense. If they come back, they come back worse. And it's like, oh, well, the spirits are in the circle. I'm like, okay, okay. No. Um, well, we got... 20,000 soldiers on the way. He only needs 10,000, but 20,000 is on the way. And yep. plus, there's also these soldiers that are like at the crystals. I think, what, there's four crystals, three crystals? Uh, I want to say those are the Holy Knights, the people coming, the soldier, 10, 20,000 20, soldiers from well, the kingdom. Yeah. Uh, but you know what? You know what I just thought about? What's up? You know what we're going to get? Rematches. We got we got the old, go the old Oni. He's going to have that rematch with that ah. one reincarnating person he's gonna kick his ass this time because he won't be in the barrier that's what's gonna happen it's mm -hmm. gonna be rematches See, i was thinking like because now that it was revealed that there was a traveling elf girl i thought we we're gonna get like like uh backup from elves that was really but weird I I was so. like, it's like I, I was like oh you're an elf oh well i didn't expect that but i understand it i believe it that's, <laughs> that's pretty much my life you're like yeah i believe it. you're now you're an elf princess and, and I was like, oh, she's a really cute human. And it's like, oh, wait, oh, she does look like an elf <laughs> without the ears. Ah, good shit. Yeah. Uh, I'm filled with, filled with hope. I don't know about y'all. But I think that wraps it up. And like always, see you in the next episode.